Entanglement now comes with an implementation of the recent Python version 3.9. You can either use the implementation that is shipped with Envimat or if you have your own Python distribution on your PC, you can select your own Python distribution. Also, there is a comfortable setup of modules and packages installed and you can easily install the default packages that are required for Envimat. All Envimat output files have been redesigned to be compatible with Python and Pandas for Python and NumPy for Python. In Leonardo, all analysis modules are linked to the internal Data Studio, which is the platform which links to the Python distribution. So Leonardo will be the first application of the Envimat set that directly links to Python and the others will follow. So for example, for the nav Data Navigator, you can still use the old displays internally, but you can send directly the data to Data Studio, where you can see a lot of different scripts, for example, the Surface Energy script, and directly run the script interactively, analyze the data, and get back the information from the Python module into a sophisticated um, graph, so like this one here. The default output is the SVG graph, which can be then stored in any software, website or whichever format you prefer. Still, you have full access to the complete Python code, where you can analyze all the different modules, um, write your own scripts to analyze them with Pandas or whichever Python module you like. It's fully integrated, so it's just a complete link to the Python distribution. And it also includes several helper in objects, such as an overview, which variables are stored in the different files. Or when you want to code the application Leonardo, for example, itself, you have full access to all the methods and the scripts and the objects that are as part of the Leonardo application. For example, this little script shows how you not only can visualize data coming from Envimet inside Leonardo, but also use the Leonardo application to change the map output, to change the map appearance, and to modify any contents of the map. For example, change the title of the map, change the number of colors that are inside the data legend, or the first color that is used actually in the map display. So just like using the GUI, you can just put it in a script press run and your map and your Leonardo application will follow your script.